So what you have in a light emitting diode display is you have thousands and thousands of little light emitting diodes, red, green, and blue, and they're scanned and then they're emitting either, you know, a, a red, green, and blue in one little pixel area. And so you can have any brightness, any color, because these LEDs are emitting varying levels of red, green, and blue that you can make a white or make a black. And you can also have any color in between. And so you have all these little individual little pixels that can be sending out light of any color and any brightness. And that is scanned to make a television raster, okay? And that's how those three systems work. The most superior one at this time is an LED. They have something a little more advanced called an organic LED. And so that is a real progression from the original uh, black and white phosphor CRT all the way up to an or organic LED display. And, it, you know, 40 years ago, they never would have even imagined the LED display that we're having now. Now, they also have other displays which are basically projection. You can have LCDs used as a, a source in a projector using the same principle where your light's coming from a projection bulb and going through the LCDs which modulate it and then produce a video. You can also have a, uh, a what's called a DLP, uh, a micro mirror device. And so basically the light's reflecting on this DLP chip, which is actually modulating the light reflecting off of it. And you can have uh, a broadcast image that way.